Dear viewers, in our previous lecture, I have just shown you that how we'll create a dog all perfectly and uh, how we'll utilize that for a uh, different criteria. And uh, also, I've told you that in this lecture, I will show you that how we'll change a definite all section and uh, also we'll change how we'll change that. Okay, I mean the shape of the default all section. Suppose now I'm clicking here wall and if I click here basic wall and suppose uh, in a previous lecture I have used four inch uh, big wall now if we need to change that I'll just click here and now if we need to change that thickness or anything then simply we have to click here edit type okay and uh, from here we're seeing here a uh, generic four inch big but uh, we are not able to change that or will not change that we'll create a duplicate of it and here if you see family uh, system family basic wall okay so we know that all of our default um, I mean elements of a structure that are that is under system family or family so what we'll do I just simply click here duplicate so here I'll just brick for each brick suppose I need a six inch wall so I'll just click uh, six inch brick then okay so see here six inch brick have created but if we if we see here the wall width have not changed right so what we'll do again you have to click here so edit then uh, simply here we have to give it six okay then okay then see here six now okay now see here a six in C all are available right so if we come here there's a four inch and here is a six inch brick wall now if you select that and from here uh, one thing you have to select at uh, what will be the base constraint so level one or le from level one or level two so it will be from level one and uh, here base offset if you want to give any I mean if you want to draw your wall above some distance from base then you can give here okay and here the I mean height of the wall what will be the height of the wall so 10 feet and um, they have another option okay up to level 1 or up to level 2 okay so as uh, our base basis from level 1 so uh, we can select here I mean if you need to draw your line from level 1 to level 2 I mean if you need to draw your uh, wall from level 1 to level 2 then you have to select here simply up to level 2 otherwise you are able to define uh, define here your required wall height so just now I'm uh, giving that value and in future I will show you about that how will utilize that all option perfectly so now if I click here and if I try to draw a wall just see escape just see now this is a four inch wall and this is a six inch also. in this way we are able to change your wall so I'm just sorry escape and again escape to change that command then delete so in this lecture I am just going to show that how we'll draw okay how we'll draw doors first of all so here okay here uh, you have to select a door from here you have to select a door from here and uh, the another thing they have some definite shape of door like uh, single flush door and this is 30 inch into I mean 30 inch width and 84 inch height so here you can select that okay you can select that and suppose uh, if we select that consider that I have selected that and similarly you can click here edit and you can uh, you can create duplicate okay and also you are able to change that height or anything you need here thickness okay so here thickness um, it's given thickness two inch thickness right so you can change that so I'll just give here what is the thickness actually what is the thickness of all actually we know that our door are also same thickness with our also as our all are four inch so I'll consider 
its thickness are also 4 inch so here 4 inch and after that I will click apply and I will click ok and also if you need different types of door ok then you can click here load family and from here I will just go door actually if you see that this option is not available for you ok this option is not available for you then you can watch our video from the playlist that how we will add that uh, family tools or how we will add template I have created already video on it so I will just click door and from here you can see here different types of door right you can see different types of door are available here just see which types of door actually you require that are available here and also commercial so let's see the many types of door actually right there are many types of door that are available here and you can select any of it okay you can select any of it and if you also go outside hardware you see this is the bundle right that like that and for residential so they have many types of door so you can add that as your requirement okay so if i uh, suppose i i want to use that door okay then what i'll do i'll click open and here from here you have to change that shape or thickness or anything so uh, i'm taking that in default okay after that okay and wait for some time so if you click here just see this is single flush and this is the door with 16 into 16 into 16 uh, width and 18 uh, height okay and uh, also if you want to edit that simply click here edit and from here you are able to edit that I mean you are able to edit that windows so here sorry uh, the doors in this way you are able to change anything so I'm just going here or uh, yes it's 4 inch so what I'll do I'll just give here thickness dimension so I'll just keep uh, dimension will be 4 inch it's 4 inch then apply then okay and here i'll just come here suppose if i need to create door here just see if i need to create door here or outside or inside just take your mouse on that line for inside in inside way or here for outside okay otherwise you can press shift Sorry, here no need to change and also if you need to create door here then also you can create here and uh, here will be able to see the dimension okay from center to center dimension you are seeing from center to center now if you want to change the dimension okay then for that I'm just giving escape then again escape then just you have to go minus okay from minus you have to go additional setting and from additional setting just go temporary dimension so from where your dimension will take from face and to door for door uh, from center line no from opening so click ok and again go architecture and again go door so here it's already selected and before that just you have to take something here swing angle or will be the swing angle here we have uh, provided uh, 90 degree and a uh, door offset actually what will be the sorry uh, seal height what is the seal height actually okay what is the seal height seal height is the height from base I mean how much above you will create your door from base right so uh, I will not give any height here okay so just simply I will just create a door here now see it's giving you the wall i mean the windows distance win, uh, windows sorry uh, door distance from face of the wall okay so now uh, suppose here i need to 
if I just come here and I need to draw all from one feet or uh, suppose one feet away so here one feet away from the wall in inside direction so I'll just or due to six inch so I can consider that is so six inch away from the inside so I'm just clicking here and uh, here uh, it's telling us this is the on error and on earning so I cannot make types of door double full glass so here and uh, actually it's giving us earning that uh, for that distance I mean for that value it's it's not able to create wall none of the created element are visible in floor plan level one view you may wait to check okay so I'll just cancel that actually these types of wind uh, windows are not sorry in these types of door are not able to use here so what I'll do I'll just again go I'll change that and from here if I select that on and obviously I'll just go here to check the thickness thickness is 2 inch I'll consider thickness is 4 inch then apply then okay after that I'll just come here and uh, when we are here just simply click shift sorry I'll uh, click click uh, space button of your keyboard to change the direction like that space 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 like that so I'm just giving the door like that so just see a door had created here 4 inch away and also by clicking here you are able to change that so 6 inch just see it's a move in 6 inch away and also from here okay from here you are able to change that direction like that like that you are able to change the direction right so in this way you are able to create windows anywhere right so when it's done okay when it's done after that so in this way you are able to use any kinds of door in a structure i hope it's okay to you so in your next lecture i'll show that how we'll create windows and how we'll see and um, another thing here so if i sorry for door if i select that door okay so for that when i have tried to use that that is not able to place here so we have to change something like uh, i'll click edit so from here uh, if i consider width will be three feet five six inch three feet six inch and also if the thickness if we consider two inch okay then apply then okay and after that if i try here just see is it okay or not just see this time it's okay this time we are able to use that door here and also we can uh, change that its direction okay so in this way we are able to use windows sorry our door anywhere like that okay so in our next lecture i'll show that how we'll use windows and how we'll uh, load different types of uh, family windows okay and also we'll see the elevation view or 3d view in our next lecture so thank you thank you very much so uh, finally if you think that if you have uh, learned something from here then please subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon and obviously leave a like and uh, also a comment because you are on like in, uh, and on comment inspires for the next work so thank you thank you very much stay connected till next video